girl you know that i'll always love you and you know that i want to fuck you rip 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 remix rip 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 remix girl you know that i have always loved you and you know that i've always wanted to fuck you in your sweet little vagina and you know that i want to be with you you know i want to sleep with you and put my penis in your anus how can you blame this on love no you can't you can't blame it on love Yo, what's up, everybody? That's right. He's back. He's fucking back, people. And he's never leaving again. It's like what The Rock said. Except for, I'm actually not gonna leave again, people. I'm never leaving. I'm here. Forever. I'm here. Until the end of time. And I know, deep in your heart, deep in your mind, deep in your body, deep in your soul, you wanna see me leave. But it's not gonna happen, people. Cause it never fucking happens. This is reality. And the reality is, I'm the motherfucking beast, bitch. Now, in this match, this was just me playing against a couple of my friends. I'm not going to say who they are, because, you know, I don't want to upload people like that. You know what I'm saying? Not my friends, anyways. So, it was actually a pretty good, pretty fun match that I played on SmackDown vs. Raw 2011. This was just a four-man battle royal with KO on. You know, no noobing and doing glitches and shit, you being and spamming moves. It was everyone attacks everyone. And that's what I like, people. I don't like all the bullshit spamming and taunting for finishers and all that bullshit. I like to play and have fun. And in order to have fun, this is what you got to do, people. You got to enjoy the game. You got to enjoy life. Because you never know if you're promised tomorrow. Okay, whatever. But yeah, people. Um, let's talk about some stuff. Now... Before, I, you know, I was really debating and I was thinking a lot about, you know, whether I should even get WWE 13. And this has been the talk. A lot of people don't want to get it. And I don't blame them because when you think about THQ, THQ fucking sucks, people. They fucking suck. They fucking suck donkey balls. Donkey balls with whiskey on them. With fucking whiskey. You ever drink whiskey and it makes your fucking nose burn? Makes your nostrils burn? It feels like someone just stuck a fucking flame in your damn nose. But yeah, THQ fucking sucks. So, I mean, in my heart, I'm thinking, you know, WWE 13 is going to fucking suck. Because, I mean, it always does. But honestly, I can have fun on WWE 13 just making calls. I don't have to play online. And even if I do play online, I mean, for the past two years, I've just been playing on fake accounts and shit, and I don't want to do it no more. It's just a game. It's just a fucking game, people. I don't care if I get uploaded anymore, because my life is going to continue. It's going to fucking continue whether someone beats me on WWE 13 or whatever fucking game. It doesn't matter. It's not going to change anything. And that's a fact. Even if you beat me, you might beat me now, but I'll beat your ass tomorrow, bitch. And when I beat you, you're going to fucking cry like a little whore that you are. So, I think I'm probably going to get WWE 13. Actually, I know I am. And if you have something negative to say about that, well, suck my balls. It's pretty simple. You know, get straight to the point with it. Suck my fucking hairy balls. Suck them. They're hairy. But yeah, um... So, I'm going to get the game just because I like making calls. I might just make videos of me making calls. And I really don't care if you like it or he likes it, if she likes it, if your mama likes it, if your daddy likes it. Either way, you're going to get it. So, when I do get it, I'm going to enjoy it. Whether the game sucks or not, I'm going to fucking enjoy it. So, let's get back into this match. This is actually a pretty good match. And this was like the first match I've played in who knows how long. Probably a couple of months. And I honestly thought I was going to lose. But I never lost my reversing skills. Which was, you know, pretty damn crazy to me. Because I thought I was going to lose them. And I was like, man, I'm about to get my ass whooped in this match. Because I haven't played in so long. But it was a pretty good match. Like I said, with me and a couple of friends of mine. I said friends of mine. Um, You see that? You saw that? 
reverse, bitch. Fucking reverse. Look at that. Reverse again, bitch. Get your ass in that corner. Finish her, bitch. Finish her, bitch. Get your ass away from me, bitch. But yeah, um, I'm going to continue making videos. I'm still going to play Call of Duty. I'm going to get Black Ops 2. So expect videos about Modern Warfare. I mean, well, not, well, Modern Warfare 3 still, Black Ops 2. WWE 13. Hell, I might play some SmackDown vs. Raw. You might see some videos about that. You might see some random videos. You're going to see reviews. I mean, my channel has multiple things. Never expect me just to upload one fucking kind of game. It's not going to happen, people. That's just not who I am. I don't play like that. You know what I do? I fucking own people. On any game, it don't matter what it is. So you're gonna see video games. You're gonna hear random reviews on UFC, WWE. You're gonna see fucking videos on new shit that's going on in the world. I mean, you're just gonna see all types of shit. So just keep, you know, watching my channel. Subscribe. Do whatever you want. You don't even gotta subscribe. Just come watch the videos. So. Yeah, let's let's just watch the end of this match right here. Just jumping around. Here we go, punk kick, bitch, punk kick, bitch. Then I, you know, show him a little stone cold, a little fucking stone cold, and KO, bitch. Oblivion wins. Peace, people. Peace.